H2O. Aqua. O. Oh. They're all different words, but in the end, whichever way you say it, it all means the same thing. Water. It's the universal substance that everyone needs to survive. The plants, animals, and of course, us. Water is life. But the fact is, the world as we know it would not exist without water. And we know that. But still, we're doing something terrible. We are polluting nature's glory and making life worse for millions of humans and animals in the world. Now, more than 780 million people lack access to clean water. That's 20 times the population of Canada. And 80% of pollution in these areas comes from land-based activities. But it's a problem for the animals, too. Each year, waste and water in coastal areas kills up to 100,000 marine mammals, 1 million seabirds, and countless fish. But before we go there, I want to take a step back. Let me introduce myself. My name is Alexandra Pipe, I'm 16 years old, and I am a global citizen. I am passionate about helping the environment. The root of my passion comes from my two favorite things in the world. The first one of them being water. I love water. I've always loved it. In fact, it's sort of my life. I love doing everything related to it, including swimming, lifeguarding, and just watching the nature. Not to mention that it helps me live. Another thing I've always loved is animals. See, I've been vegetarian ever since I was eight years old because of animal rights, and I've had just about every pet, from birds to gerbils to cats to rabbits to dogs, you name it. This is also what has inspired me to want to change the living conditions of animals who aren't as fortunate to have homes, but are instead being pushed out of their habitats by water pollution. I know this as a fact from observing a lake near my house. Ducks, fish, and geese used to thrive there, but are now being pushed out by what has become a murky swamp. But I know we can change this. We can organize clean water projects and fundraisers to clean up lakes and rivers on a local level. We can educate the next generation, children at a young age and teens, on why not to impulsively litter in our environment. In all, we must totally change our lifestyles and mindsets because the fact is, without a world to live in, how can we live? This is why going to the EF Environmental Conference for Youth would be a life-changing experience for me. Because it would be a chance to meet other teens who have the same ideas, the same goals as me. More importantly, it would be a chance to meet others who want to change the world as well. And it would give me an opportunity to achieve my and everyone else's goal as a team. Because I know we can do this, we just have to try.